This video will go through a student view of handing assignments in. Starting off first with the teacher view, as a teacher when you create an assignment, you have an option here to create any sort of Google document or you can add a pre-existing document in. When you choose any sort of Google product, such as a document, slide, or sheet, you then get a drop-down menu, which will allow you a few options. So the bottom one is to make a copy for each student. That will mean that this, it'll copy this document for each individual student, saving it into their own drive so that they can edit it and no one else can see it and their changes will be saved and they can submit it. This second one here, the students can edit the file. This means your whole class is editing together. So it is a live document where everyone can see or only can view. That just means they can see the assignment, they can see the document, they can't do anything to it. If I were to choose make a copy for each student, The students would then get a view that looks like this. So when they open their assignment in their classwork, they press view assignment. It, the instructions say, please see attached document for your questions. The document is over here because it has made a copy to me as a student. So the document has my name on it as well as the assignment name on it. When I click to open it, I can type in my answers and when I'm ready, I can either press the turn in button here at the top or I can press the turn in button here. Any changes I make to that doc document are being saved. They're saved in my drive as well, so I cannot lose this document. So when I'm ready, I can press turn in, or if I wanted to add something else, I could press add or create and add in anything else I need for the assignment. It'll ask me if I'm sure I'm ready to turn in. I press yes. As a student, if I had any questions, I could add a private comment to my teacher here and if I wasn't understanding something, that's where I would submit it. In other uh, assignments, when they click on the assignment, um, if there's a video or something attached, the student can just click into it and it will play for them or take them to the site that you're requesting them to go to. And then if you have asked them to write something about what they've observed, then you would press the add or create button as a student, create a document or slides or drawing, whatever you are creating. Click it here. Again, it will create the document with your name as well as with the assignment name on it. As you can see on the top, that is the name that is saved to my student Google Drive. Then I could type whatever I want to type and again, turning it in. If I exit out of that document, it is still saved there. I have an opportunity to add in a file um, from my computer or a link to something else or something from my Google Drive as well.